guys okay i am so frazzled right now oh my god it's currently 12 15 right now and we're having the photographer come over at 12 30 and i need to do my nails <sighs> jump scare i didn't have time to do my nails so i'm gonna use these ones also i'm shaking because i had my coffee oh my god please come with glue Who's that? It looks like an absolute mess back there because those are um, Cruz's outfit. So yeah, before. Oh, I need to fix this piece. Also, I'm kind of glad I didn't go to the nail salon because my cuticles are so bad, it's embarrassing. So it's probably a good thing. Don't want to embarrass myself. I like never do stick on nails, so I don't even know how much glue I'm supposed to put on. Oh, I need the fan going. Where's the fan remote? Literally right here still need to get crew ready and he hates getting ready so we're doing that last because yeah these are cute okay <laughs> And I think she's here. The curls have entered the chat. I missed my curls and it's been a minute. So I was like, okay, we need to have a moment. They are thriving. Okay, I did put in like a little clip. I don't know if you can see it. I feel like balayage looks so good with curly hair. It just brings like so much dimension and you can like see the curls more if that makes sense. Like it looks more defined. If there's some pieces that are like lighter, just like more dimension. I'm like obsessed with it. Wearing my go-to mom fit. I need to order more of these from airy they're like my favorite leggings they're the crossover leggings oh no free feet but um they're the flare ones and then i'm wearing this abercrombie jacket jalen's gonna be so excited when he sees my hair when he gets back home from work because he's like obsessed when i have my curly hair he gets mad when i straighten it as he should he's gonna eat this up right now i'm filling out this form because i'm going on a brand trip with one of my favorite skincare companies you guys probably know who it is i use their cream like every single night and when they asked speaking of the devil <laughs> just kidding do you like my hair yeah, girl. <laughs> that's not even a question. <laughs> I'm so excited because we just got the itinerary and it is going to be so much fun and so relaxing too. I feel like I really need this and it's going to be good for me, but I'm going to miss Cruz so much. Oh my gosh, I'm not going to be okay, but yeah, it's going to be fun. I also need to go to the mailbox because I've been waiting for this package, so let's get it. Oh my God, I forgot to mention that I just got the pictures back in there way too cute like i am obsessed they turned out so good she always kills it i'll include them right here because they're too cute what do you have planned <laughs> i don't have anything planned what do but you I was have telling to them, say i was telling them you're obsessed with the curls and it makes them act up yeah i always love the curls the curls is the only option yeah and when you straighten your hair i'll be getting mad i'll be i'll be fighting demons <laughs> yeah when i get it he what <laughs> when i straighten my hair and get a spray tan oh he does Whoa, not want to talk to me that's like the worst that's like the double <laughs> ever i feel like a lot of boyfriends do like it just yes i know the smell is not nice i think the whole mission it would be a spray tan hair straighten and lip gloss those are the so dumb the worst yeah you need some more water. I need more water. Guys, my toxic trait is always wearing this crew neck. You guys already know the other one. The gray one with like the, the red stripe. It's my toxic trait. There's just something about that just cannot top it. I'm also like this close to putting my hair up and I'm trying my best not to because the curls are thriving today. We're walking to the mailbox. I'm taking crew because this package is for him. So he has to come. Okay. Are you confused? Because I am too. <laughs> It is so cold outside. Okay, let's see if I can open this with one hand. Ah. Woo! When it's windy, crew does not like the wind. <laughs> Ooh -hoo. Oh man, how am I gonna hold all this? This was not my brightest idea. <sighs> it's cold. Next thing I knew, she's all up on me screaming, yeah, 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 yeah. Jump, jump, jump. Clap, clap, clap. Clap, clap, clap your hands, clap your hands together. One thing about Crew is he just wants to walk. He knows how to crawl, but he just does not want to. 
He just wants to walk. Also, he just scratched his face. I swear we have to like cut his fingernails like every two days because they grow so fast. I wanted to show you guys what we got. Ordered him more clothes. Probably doesn't need more clothes, but I just can't deal. With Crew, his vibe is like, we love putting him in sweatsuits because they're so easy and just so cute on him. Like the oversized sweatsuits are just, mm, just so cute. Up. My favorite place to get them, not sponsored. The company's called Mini Ollie. So the first one, here. You can be in it too. The first new one that we got is this one and it says Brooklyn on it. What do Ooh. we think? Isn't that so cute? I like that. Yeah, so it comes with a sweatshirt and matching pants. What do we think? You like do that? Do you like this one? New York. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> Say we're Brooklyn. I think he likes this one. At. And then the next one, which is so cute. It has smiley faces everywhere. It's this purple and teal smiley face one and then it comes with the matching pants thoughts what yeah. do you think he said yeah mm. oh yeah, yeah i like the purple one so much i grabbed this one as well which is like Ooh. a cream one with green on it yeah those are the vibes hi crew he's obsessed with this sloth hi crew what do you think about this one he says he likes the other ones more but it's fine i got your sloth oh. <laughs> And then just got this in an Amazon package, and um, I heard oh, these ones are really good. Yeah, these are the. He lifted it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're such a big boy. Come here. Come here. <laughs> he's like, can you? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> and plus, oh, he has something to say. Ordered him these sippy cups because I heard they're really good and they're leak proof. It's a weighted straw. So, yeah, I wish they had different colors. They just had green or I think it was pink, but it's fine. He'll start using these. Ignore the boogies. We still need to grab those. What do you have to say? It's the breathing for me. <laughs> hey, crew. Oh my goodness. <laughs> He's getting so big. What is happening? He looks a little drunk. <laughs> Jalen's making seafood pasta tonight and I'm so excited. He makes the best pasta. So I took out the salmon and then he bought some scallops. I wish you guys could taste his pasta because it's so good. Come on, crazy boy. Whoa. Yum. You're probably wondering what this is. I got a new rug and I wanted to get this for the living room because we put like the play mat down, but it doesn't give me cozy vibes. It's great for crew, but I found something that's pretty much like equivalent. So I got this washable spill proof rug and it literally has like the same pattern as the play mat that we have now. And there's also like a foam thing under it that we can put. So it's like the perfect combo. Also, we want to put the play mat in the office because we're gonna turn that into a whole playroom. This room's still gonna be pretty much like a playroom, but we're gonna go ham in the office and change that into like crew's dream of a playroom. I still have the old rug under this, but we're gonna like move, we're gonna move this into the office and put the new rug down. I'm so excited. The office is kind of sad right now. Like we use it for like half baby storage and we never really even go in the office that much. We're pretty much gonna take all of this out and turn it into his little playroom. Like imagine it saying like Cruise playroom right here. It's gonna be so cute. And then we'll probably have to take off these doors. It's gonna be perfect. He's gonna love it. I'm also filming a TikTok. <laughs> My dad and brother are also coming over because they're gonna help Jalen move the couch because I do not wanna sweat right now. Let's be real. Okay, let's open this. Wow, that was violent. Oh, perfect timing. Guys, look how tall Nico is. Like, what's going on? This is the foam part and then this is the rug. Okay, let's do this, okay? Okay. <laughs> Guys, look at the house right now. It looks like we're moving. Final reveal. I think this looks so much better. Don't worry, these aren't shoes. I just wear these in the house. It's definitely giving more comfy vibes. Oh my God, not slothy. I'll link it below, but it's the Azra Ivory Berry one, I believe. But it literally matches perfect 
with this pillow that I got from Target. Hi, Benji. Oh, Benji, bend it over, okay. I feel like we need to like actually test it out though. He's so cute. And what can we use to test this out? I'll open up a poppy because I want one right now. Guys, I really am in my poppy era. I feel like I'm so late to it. Oh, is this clear? Oh my gosh. Okay, maybe that's not the bed. Yeah, no. Oh, okay. I'm just making a mess. We need like orange juice. That's not what I was looking for. This is like the only drink that's colored. I'm low key scared. Let's test this out. Oh, Benji. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, okay, let's see. Oh, what the hell? Where did it go? I'm like, how? You literally can't even tell where it was. I'm also filming on TikTok. If you have dogs or babies, kids, toddlers, anyone, anything, I feel like this rug is so perfect for like any family. When we bought this couch, yes, it's white. And like so many people were like, why are you getting a white couch when you guys are gonna have babies and stuff? It does sound pretty dumb, but like we made sure that everything's washable because we know it's gonna get messy and that's fine. These covers also come off and you can put it in the washer. So everything in here is washable. Love that. Also a little throwback, everyone was calling me a sad beige mom. Now look at me. Look at all this color. Who even am I? Whoa! Okay, okay, okay. Let me grab you. Come here, shoddy. I'm really excited to start his playroom. <laughs> oh my god. I'm obsessed with him. Look how cute his outfit is though. He's wearing like a hoodie. Did you? I need to change you. I knew I smelled something. <laughs> Jalen's upstairs getting ready and we're gonna go to the doctors because Crew keeps like holding his ear and in my last vlog I mentioned that he was allergic to his antibiotics for his ears. Um, he can never have like amoxicillin, penicillin, like nothing. Um, and he was taking it for eight days and it took the eighth time for him to get an allergic reaction, which is so crazy. That's what freaks me out about like introducing like peanut butter because like the first time we give it to him, he might not have a reaction. And then like the 15th time he could have a reaction. I'm like, this is so stressful. How do parents do this? When we went to the doctor a couple days ago, she said that in his right ear, his ear infection's almost gone. And then his left ear was fine but she said to like come back if he's like holding on to it and stuff like that she thought it was gonna like go away since he's been on the antibiotics for like eight days but it's still here to play so we're gonna go back hopefully they can give him something else and not have a reaction or i think there's like this like ear infection shot <coughs> and he has this gross cough clap 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 <laughs> let's go clap 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 we're making a stop at the mall. We forgot his freaking stroller attachment, so Jalen's carrying him. I was gonna baby wear him, but Jalen insisted that he would just hold him, so love that. Yeah. But this is his first, like, mall outing. Whoa, what do you think? He's like, what is this? First stop is Zara. We're gonna see if they have any cute clothes. Family check. I used to wear this outfit, like, every day when I was pregnant. Okay, let's see. Oh, this sweater's so cute. I like that. Oh my gosh, look at these. These are too cute. Separating, they're going to the guy's stuff. Love you. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go look at the girl's stuff. Not me instantly going to the sweats. These look so cozy. Are you kidding? These are cute. I feel like my nipples are... They're exposed. <laughs> you know when your like, nipples are uneven? That's how, that's what was happening. I wear this shirt so much. I need to get another one. But White Fox discontinued this. I really like this, so. Might have to get a couple of these. These are only $8, so I might get every color. I like the blue, and let's get the black. We don't have time to try these on, so hopefully I like them. I think I will. I mean, they're just like basic tank tops. Bag secured. Two, one. Up. We're in a pretty big room. Woo! Who's that handsome boy? That's the handsome boy. <laughs> That's the handsome boy. Yeah. yeah. He still has a small ear infection, but it's not bad. But she's gonna give us antibiotics mm. if in a couple days he's still holding his ears, then we give it to him. But. Hopefully it'll be better. <laughs> so. We got back from the doctors and Crew still has like some liquid in his ears. She said in a couple days it should clear up, but if he keeps like holding his ears and it's really bothering him in a couple days, then she gave me a new prescription and I have that paper so I can just go to the pharmacy and get that. So hopefully his ears get it together because I do not like this. They're being very rude to Crew. 
and he's not having it. Right now I wanna meal prep some overnight oats because that sounds so good in the morning and that's like the perfect mom meal. So I wanna like meal prep that. Um, I've never really had overnight oats, so we'll see. But I keep seeing like TikToks of overnight oats and I really want to make them. I laid out all of my ingredients. I just went to the grocery store and got a couple of things, but I wanna make one of them like a peanut butter and jelly one and then the other one like a berries coconut situation you know i got my cute cups here i wish they all matched you know those cute mason jars i wish i had those but these will work it's fine it looks so dark in our kitchen because it is so gloomy out it's like been raining forever i'm so sick of washington i'm ready for spring and summer because this lighting is not it i'm just gonna wing it i don't really know what i'm doing I cleaned the blueberries and strawberries and cut up the strawberries. Okay, let's put the oats in there first. I'm just using just these oats. I'm just doing a serving of these in each one. I just can never be aesthetic, okay? I just can't. I wish I was as aesthetic as Kaylee May on TikTok. Her videos, insane. Also, I didn't know this, she lives in Washington. Girl, let's hang out. Please help me with my house. Kaylee would never. Okay, and then I think you use like the same ratio. I don't know. I don't want them to be like super thick, you know? Please, right? Do not spill this. Does that look right? No, I feel like I need way more than that. These oats are like thick. I'm just gonna like eye it. Beautiful. Let's do this one first. I'm gonna add vanilla to all of these. Okay, let's start with this one first. Okay, we'll add some almonds, coconut chips, blueberries, strawberries, and some chia seed. Oh, I should have put the chia seed. Oh wait, I'll do that with the next one. Is that it? Why is that so easy? Okay, first one done. This one's giving me peanut butter jelly vibes. So let's do that. Um, I think we should put the peanut butter in first. This one's gonna be peanut butter. Chia seed, sorry. <laughs> chia seeds, almonds. Coconut, cinnamon, that looks foul, <laughs> but I bet it's gonna taste so good. Done. Last one is the PB&J. Chia seeds, I don't wanna put too many in because I heard it's like not good for your stomach, right? Or is that when you just like eat them like this? I don't remember what I saw online. Okay, peanut butter, mix, 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 mix. Oh, she thick. Jelly, this is fun. Do you guys like this? <laughs> I'm not feeling coconut for this one. I'll put the rest of the strawberries in there. Okay, I'm so excited to try these. I'll update you guys in this vlog if they're good. We'll do like a taste test, but they're beautiful. Okay, I will be back for you. I'm really hoping those oats are good because that's like the perfect mom meal because it's so quick and it's already like made and prepped. I wanted to like open up a little bit because I feel like I've been like struggling with a couple of things that I've been like trying to work on. Um, And I've been kind of like leaving it on the back burner. I wanna like share this with you guys because I feel like you guys can hold me accountable in a way and someone might relate to it. I've always struggled with this, but the past couple months it's gotten not very good. It's my dermatillomania. If you don't know what it means it's pretty much like skin picking i don't know what it is i know it stems from my ocd and it's nothing to be embarrassing about but i just feel embarrassed like talking about it because it's like get it together girl like stop picking it is so freaking hard and i just get like so disappointed in myself because i'm like i'm trying to be like the best version of myself like for myself obviously but also for crew and i don't know oh my god benji's staring at me do you see him? <laughs> he like knows I need love. With the skin picking, it's like a way that I cope with stress or anxiety. I don't know what it is, but I'm really, really trying to work on it. But I get so in my head and just feel horrible about myself when it gets really bad. Like right now, it's really bad. Like I have band-aids on my fingers because it was not good. Right now, it's mainly my cuticles. It used to be my face and pimples, but I've gotten better with that. I think me getting those like laser treatments for my acne scars really helped because I'm like, don't pick your face because you literally just got laser for it. So now I'm on to my fingernails. I haven't gone to the nail salon in like almost three months because I'm too embarrassed to go because my cuticles are so bad. Like, I just, I don't even want to show anyone. It's just been really tough, and I feel like people are going to think I'm, like, weird for it. See, so yeah, I've been really trying to, like, work on it because 
it hurts like I need to stop like I'll be washing my face and I'm like ow because I have like hangnails that I picked to the extreme it's not fun it's not very sanitary I've been really down about that and I'm really trying to work on it because it's like a mental battle every day with this if you're going through this just know you're not alone and I literally hate myself every time I do it and also even with like filming and like me holding products like I'll hide my hand around the product so you don't see my cuticles because I'm so embarrassed about it so that's been really fun love having anxiety and OCD it's the best thing ever <laughs> yeah this has been fun I feel like I'm just like complaining right now but I'm like okay we're already here I've been having such bad pelvic pain definitely because of pregnancy and like giving birth and stuff like I don't think I've ever really talked about it yeah ever since I gave birth like my pelvic pain it's gone up and down um, but I've been super consistent with working out lately and like lifting heavy weights and stuff I even had to cancel my training session with my trainer today because it literally hurt to walk I need to go to like a pelvic floor therapist because this is not fun and I'm trying to explain where it's out but it's pretty much my pubic bone it feels like it's super bruised and when I walk it's like uncomfortable and sometimes when I lay on my side I can feel it and I just have this constant urge that I have to like pee and I don't have a UTI. I really need to do like more pelvic floor exercises because this is not fun. It's just gone to the point where when I'm walking, it hurts, which is not a way to live. I just really need to prioritize this because if I want to get pregnant, I really need to prioritize this and like get it figured out and heal my pelvic floor because that's like the base of like your core and like all of that. And especially since we want to have more kids, if I don't heal this, like it probably will get worse. So I don't want that to happen. Yeah, I don't know. I just want to share this because you guys are my besties and I really hope this like pushes me to like be more accountable for it. Just know everyone goes through their struggles and on a positive note, I am so excited because Love is Blind is on tonight and if you don't watch Love is Blind, go watch it. It is so good this season. It's on Netflix and I'm just like so obsessed with it. Julian and I are gonna watch the new episodes once crew goes to bed tonight and I'm so excited. The season is just too good. If you watch that show, you know how iconic Jessica is. When you see and realize what you missed out on you are going to choke <laughs> i love jessica on love is blind she is so iconic for that i'm so excited for the new episodes i really need to do the laundry because i have so many piles around the house that are just chilling here's another one <laughs> i turn on my lo-fi hip-hop so hopefully this motivates me to do the laundry probably not but it needs to be done. It probably looks like I haven't gotten anything done, but I've actually gotten a lot done, promise. I was gonna film a time lapse for you guys, but I need to clear my SD card. I have too much footage on it and I need to go through it. I have like stuff from giving birth and I don't wanna like accidentally delete something. I'm on TikTok and there's this new trend where people are like asking how old you look. Guys, how old do I look? <laughs> I don't know. How old do I look? I'm so curious but also scared because there is this one girl that uploaded one and she's like 27 and people were like you look 48 crazy this might hurt my feelings but let me know down below i'm 26 i feel like i look 26 but let me know am i gonna regret this <laughs> it's crazy that i'm closer to 30 now i still feel like i'm like 23 we're 26 out here sometimes i look at crew and i'm like whoa like i'm literally your mom excuse me <laughs> i don't know what it is but like i just look at him and i'm like my body literally created you like i'm your mom me insane i was talking a little bit about this on tiktok but he's at this age where it's so freaking fun like this age is so much more fun to me compared to like the zero to three months and like um newborn stage it's like dangerous because it's making me want another one i feel like two under two would be so hard but also so worth it for them because they can be like little besties but i don't know if i'm like mentally ready for that i feel like I'm like at the point where like I'm starting to feel like I'm back to myself but at the same time I'm like he needs a little bestie. I also need to like figure out my pelvic floor situation. If any of you guys have experienced two under two let me know how it is. My aunt actually had three under three which sounds so chaotic to me but like seeing them be adults and like be best friends is so cute and like I don't know. Let me know down below because I know obviously it's going to be hard regardless of the age gap. Two under two would just be so cute. Like, okay, let's say I got pregnant right now, which I'm not pregnant. I'm about to start my period. It would be an 18 month age gap. To infinity and beyond. 
Oh, I need to not watch these videos. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna include it right here. Oh my gosh, yeah, I need to get off TikTok. That's not helping. I'm gonna charge my camera and finish laundry. Good morning, let's try these overnight oats. Ooh, crew only woke up twice last night and that was beautiful. Let's see what they're working with. Oh, I think I still have makeup under my eyes. I feel like I needed to add more, more milk just cause it's so thick. Okay, let's get a good bite with everything in it. Cheers. I feel like I definitely need more milk. There wasn't enough milk for it to make the oats like softer. You know what I mean? But the taste isn't bad. I like how quick it is and I definitely need honey in it. Not bad. Just not my favorite. I don't know if you guys can see, but the oats are still kind of hard. I think I need like a lot more like almond milk to soak them up. It's all right. Okay, not me making my normal oatmeal. They were um, not giving what they needed to give. We'll work on it. <laughs> Cheers. This isn't sponsored by the way, but I got my new mixed tiles in the mail. Um, we got the new photo shoot pictures. I made an order and I already got them. It came so quick. So I want to put those up. We're going to replace those ones with the new ones. Oh my gosh. Stop it right now. Oh my goodness. This is my favorite one probably. Look at his little face. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, yes. I don't know what's going on with me, but I'm in like my country music era. I have never liked country in my life, but like there's something with Zach Bryan that just hits. Like I am obsessed with his music. I don't know what's happening to me because I'm like an EDM girly and like rap hip hop. I've never liked country, but like, I'm starting to like country and it's it's a little weird. Jalen's like, what is going on with you? Because in the car lately, I've been playing Zach Bryan and Morgan Wallen and he is so confused. He's like, what is happening? I don't know. There's just something about them. Let's put these up. This is what it's gonna look like. It's pretty much the same ones as over there, but just updated pictures. So let's do this. I'm kidding that probably took me like eight minutes max but this is so bittersweet look how good this looks oh my gosh i will forever be obsessed with this picture but wow adorable my parents have crew so cheers Ooh, whoo. i got a moscow mule like always and then what'd you get it's called a wild thing beer kind of like thing. a blue mutant yeah kind of like a blue moon yuck well he made that strong i'm gonna get the barbecue chicken salad I'm gonna get the wings in. I got my favorite appetizer ever. This is brown sugar bread. It's exactly what it sounds like. It's cheese, brown sugar, and bread. Sounds weird, but it's so good. Dipped with in ranch. Mm. It's too good. Here's my salad, and then Jalen got some wings and fries, and we have like 50 million ranches. Mm -hmm. 